Hello and welcome. Thank you so much for being here. My name is Jenny J and today we are doing a toned dancer arms workout where we're going to sculpt your shoulders, biceps, triceps, back, core, and so much more. For today's class, you will need your body, a mat, and maybe a light set of dumbbells. I have three pounds here, but you're more than welcome to grab canned goods or water bottles. Trust me, you don't need to go any heavier than that because we're going to be doing a lot of high reps. So you'll really feel the burn. We're going to just start with our body weight first, getting that tension into our arms before we add weight. Make sure to grab water and towel down whenever you need it. Let's go ahead and get started with our warm up. So let's bring those feet nice and wide. Let's make sure that your toes are pointing forward. Sit up nice and tall or stand up nice and tall. Open up that chest. Bring, bring those shoulders back and down. We're gonna start with four big deep breaths. Inhale, hands up. Exhale, again. Nice bend in those legs. Really reaching those hands to the sky. Getting that beautiful oxygen in. Good, let's bring those hands out to a T position and give me small shoulder circles back. Good. Now I want you to think about keeping those fingers nice and energized as if you're reaching in opposite directions, creating that tension in your shoulders. Reverse, bring it forward. Now you might not feel the burn just yet, but you will, trust me, it's gonna grow, it's gonna build. If at any point you need to just kind of relax those arms, you're more than welcome to just bring them down, shake it out, and then come right back into it. Nice big arm circles here. Now notice how I'm getting my whole body working. So don't just stand there like a robot, reverse. Keep a nice soft bend in those knees and allow that upper body to just move with you. We have eight. Keep going, four, three, two, and one. Now let's bring those hands out in that T position. Really reach nice and long. I want you to keep those hips exactly where they are. Now take a look. You're gonna shift your rib cage side to side as if you're being pulled. You're in the middle of a tug of war game and you're getting stretched out. We're getting into those abs. So think about pressing your belly button to the spine and feel those rib cages or that rib cage just shifting side to side. All right, let's bring those hands on the hips. We're gonna go open, close. I want you to think about opening up that chest, then rounding the shoulders as if you're getting punched in the stomach right here. Good. All right, a little bit faster, yeah? Up, down. Good, getting into those abs because why not? We can always use a little bit of uh, core action here. And I want you to make sure that you don't stand stiff. You just want to allow your body to move to the music. Let's bring those hands out. Now we're gonna go ahead and go into some standing arms, just using our body weight. So from here, we're gonna reach this right hand up, 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 up. Palm is facing forward. You can bring this hand out in a T position. Now don't forget about it. Don't let it start dropping down, yeah? Good. Right arm comes to the side. Palm is still facing forward. Getting into those shoulders here. Now notice how my rib cage is still moving, right? Let's try to shake out any stiffness in the body. Four, three, switch sides. Left arm goes up, up, up. Now bring that bicep right next to the ear and then really reach to the sky here. Take lots of space. We have four, three, out to the side. Good, think about really reaching as if someone is pulling or as if you're grabbing something. Good, are you feeling the burn in those shoulders yet? I am, reach up both arms, woo! I told you that burn was gonna start to build on you. Keep going. We have four, three, two out to the side. Oh, I promise you, I'll give you a small break here. Shoulders are definitely getting nice and warm. Eight, seven, six, 
five, four, three. All right, from here, you're gonna bring those elbows into the rib cage. Palms are facing up. I want you to think about squeezing those biceps, right? Creating that internal tension. You're gonna start to reach up with that right arm as if you are kind of leading with the palm of your hand. You wanna press up, up. Feeling that bicep muscle start to work. And don't forget about this left hand, right? Keep it up here. We have four, three, two, and switch. Up, up, up. Again, you're pressing something away, creating that internal tension. Good, we have four, three, alternating, right, left. Up, 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 up. Good, flex those palms. We have eight, seven, six, five, four, three. Let's do both arms, yeah? Come on, press, press, press. You're doing so awesome. Who knew you could get an arm workout just by flailing your arms in the sky, right? Four, three, two, all right. Have a little shake here. Woo, we've been working hard. All right, from here, we're gonna bring those hands out in front of us. Let's go into a stop sign position, right? So stop in the name of love. <laughs> and then we're gonna bring this hand to our shoulder and push forward. So push, push. Getting into our chest muscles as well as our shoulders. And I want you to pretend like you're moving a really heavy door out of the way. Switch. <sighs> Creating that internal resistance and allowing the body to move with the music. We have four, three, two. Now palms are gonna face forward. Now you're gonna bring them together. Squeeze, squeeze. It's as if you're grabbing like a beach ball and you're trying to pop it. Good. From here, let's go crisscross. Crossing those wrists. Slightly leaning to each side. Good, stay here with eight. Last four, three, two, and one. Let's bring those hands up and down, up and down. It's almost like you're creating like a halo with your hands, palms face out, and then they come back in. Yeah? Let's go double time, a little bit quicker. Up, down, up, down. Feeling those shoulders work. We have eight, seven, six, five. Moving on to triceps. Now take a look. We're gonna bring those feet shoulder distance apart. Soft bend in those knees, hinge forward. Your chest is open. You're gonna keep those elbows nice and glued to the rib cage and you're gonna press out back behind you. Here we go. Press, press. Press, getting into the triceps right here. Now, once you have this move down, let's have those eyes looking down as well to lengthen the back of the neck. Hold it out here, pulse up. Keep those arms straight. Now, make sure that your booty's engaged. Same with your core, protecting that spine. All right, take a look. You're gonna bring this right arm, bring it out. Out, out. So the hand is behind the hip. This is gonna help you get the back of the arms here. We have four, three, two, and switch. Feeling that tension in those arms. Make sure that you have some energy reaching through those fingers. Eight, seven, six. We have four, three. Now take a look. We go bend and straight. Bend, straight, bend, straight. Pushing something behind you. We have four, three, two, and one. Relax, good. Stand on up, shake it out. How do you feel? Hopefully you're feeling good and are ready for more. We're gonna go ahead and get those light dumbbells or whatever you have at home. If you have 
canned goods, water bottles. Again, you don't need anything beyond three pounds. I promise you, if you're already feeling the burn, we're gonna feel that burn even more. So let's go ahead and just with the right arm, we're gonna press it out to the side. Here we go, singles, out, out. So every single time I extend it, comes right back in, elbow to the rib cage, palm is facing forward. We have four, three, now let's press it up to the sky. <sighs> Bringing that bicep right next to the ear, straightening that arm, eight. We have four, three, two, now let's punch it forward. Keep that elbow high. Good. Make sure that you're not hyperextending that elbow. We have four, three, then switch sides. Press out. Oh yeah, just in time, right? Right shoulder was burning. <laughs> Stay here. Keep those knees soft. Smile, you're having fun. Four, three, two, shoulder press. Bring it up. Breathe. You're doing great. We have eight, seven, and four, three. Let's punch it forward. Again, elbows nice and wide here. Dumbbell comes right back to the chest. We have eight, seven. Now we're gonna go into the right arm back to our bicep platter. So I kind of think of this like a bicep platter, like you're holding a tray of food and then you're just like bringing it up to the sky. You're like, here you go. We have four, three, two switch sides. Here we go, up, up, up. Nice job, make sure you're breathing throughout this. It's gonna help you. Eight, seven, six, five. Now remember that halo? We're gonna do it super slow. So it goes up and down, nice and slow. Up and down. Two more, up and down. Now we're gonna alternate right and left a little bit quicker. Up, down, up, down, up, down. Now make sure that you're not just like dropping the dumbbell without any sense of control. You wanna make sure that you have control, both arms please. Up, down, up, down. Creating kind of like this semicircle with the arms. Four, three, two. Now let's have both elbows into the chest. What we're gonna do is extend it out and bring it back in. All right, so with that beat, just extending out, keeping that elbow nice and high in line with the shoulder. Switch arms, here we go. Oh yeah. Woo! Hopefully you're feeling that burn. We have four, and three, and two, and one. Let's go shoulder press. Up, oh yes. Oh yeah, now we're feeling the burn here. Keep going, we have four, Three, two. Now let's bring those elbows and wrists in. Woo, right in front of that face. Now keep those elbows shoulder height. Don't let them drop here. I know, I know you're burning. Keep it up. All right, one more, one more. Hold it here. We're gonna pulse it up. Oh my gosh. Oh. Let's go, keep going. All right, we're gonna go into our tricep kickbacks. Four, three, two, all right. Woo, nice relief here. Just single tricep kickbacks. Bring those elbows into the rib cage. Straightening those arms. Palms are facing into the body. All right, just one arm. Press it back. Going a little bit faster. Other hand is just resting on my thigh. We have Eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, and switch. 
Now, we are going pretty fast, so you wanna make sure that you have weight that you feel in control of. Should not be too heavy. All right, from here, we're gonna extend both arms down, row into the rib cage. Think about squeezing those back muscles. Open up that chest, squeezing those shoulder blades together. Eyes are looking down. Eight more, please. Up. Breathe. Nice flat back here. Four. Three. Two. I'm going to face forward. Reverse fly. So we bring those dumbbells out. Slight micro bend in those elbows. Getting into the back of the shoulders. Focusing on your posture. Woo. All right, stand up, shake it out. How we doing? Hopefully we're feeling great. We have a few more moves with the weights and then we're gonna drop it down, go into some standing abs and then we're gonna call it a day. So you're gonna bring those dumbbells or canned goods together. You're gonna create a halo around the head. Keeping those elbows nice and tight to the skull. This is so good for shoulder mobility, but also tricep work. Keep going. Let's do eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two. Now let's hold it back behind us. Press it up, up and down, up and down. Now a common mistake here is that elbows come really wide. I want you to tuck it in. Oh yeah. We got eight more and then we're gonna drop these weights down. Eight, seven, six, five. You got this. Four, three, two, and one. Set them down. Ooh. All right, I told you we we're gonna finish off with some standing abs. Get that core in there because why not? Let's bring those feet nice and wide. Open up the chest. Let's bring those hands to the hips. We're gonna go into a square. So it goes forward, side, back, side. Again, forward, side, back, side. We want to master this rib cage isolation. Yeah, great core workout. Really pressing the rib cage in each direction, keeping those hips exactly where they are. Good. Now we're gonna smooth out those edges. Circle around. Hey. So remember, it's not really the hips moving. Keep those hips exactly where they are and just focus on the ribs here. Let's do that square other way. Forward, side, back, side. Forward, side, back, side. Two more. One more, forward, side. Smooth out those edges, here we go. Around, around. Bring it around town. We have four, three, two. Nice big inhale, hands up. You made it. Woo, oh yeah. Arms kind of feel like jello, but that's a good sign that we worked it out. One more. All right, let's bring that hand across the body. Pull it in, shoulder stretch. Let's bring the shoulder away from the ear. Open up the chest and switch. Nice work. Hopefully you're feeling a really good burn. We're gonna bring this hand behind our head. Pull that elbow back for a tricep stretch. Switch sides. Let's try to keep your chin off your chest here. All right, from here, we're gonna clasp those fingers together. Bring those hands forward as you round the upper shoulders. So chin to your chest, rounding that spine. And then from here, inhale those hands up. Bring it back behind you, opening up that chest. Pull those hands down as you look to the sky, getting those triceps. Amazing work. Let's finish off with two big deep breaths. Inhale. 
Exhale, one more. Exhale, you made it. Awesome job. Thank you so much.